Let's get to Phil LeBeau with more on Tesla and whether that stock is ready to rally. Hey, Phil. Hey, Melissa, when you look at Tesla's shares after they report deliveries over the last three years, they tend to move higher. Now, what we've seen since Friday when Tesla reported its sales is the stock was down a little bit. It's indicating a little higher this morning, but no appreciable movement. Remember, on Friday morning, the company reported that it delivered a little over 200,000 vehicles for the second quarter. That was roughly in line with expectations. The exact number, 201,250 vehicles. Those deliveries, it's sort of been the, the point over the last three years where you see the stock move higher because we crunched the numbers. We had our data team crunch the numbers. What happens with Tesla shares two weeks before the quarterly delivery announcement and two weeks after the quarterly delivery announcement? No comparison in terms of performance. The shares move higher. There you go, Joe. Higher in the two weeks after the announcement appreciating almost 17 percent, not much movement in the two weeks before the announcement. But keep in mind, all of this is because you have people who are, A, maybe encouraged by the delivery news, and B, buying into the stock ahead of the quarterly financials reports, because we usually get deliveries about four to six weeks before the quarterly financials report. We're going to get those from Tesla and its Q2 results. That's expected later this month, guys. So watch Tesla shares over the next couple of weeks. Let's see if the trend holds that we've seen over the last couple of years of the stock moving up after it reports deliveries. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.